Meow, meow. It's October 16 and today in Philippine history, Rosa Rosal was born in 1931. She was born Florence Danon to Julio Danon, who was of French-Egyptian descent, and Gloria Del Barrio, who was from Pampanga. Now, after the war, Florence was walking home from her job at the San Lazaro Hospital when she was spotted by film producer Luis Nolasco. He offered her her very first film contract. She took the screen name Rosa Rosal. Her shapely silhouette and her 22-inch waistline captured the public's imagination. In the 1950s, Rosa Rosal would be best known for her daring appearances on film. She had no qualms about wearing bathing suits or being in kissing scenes or playing the villainous femme fatale on screen. Off screen, she led a quiet and private life. She enrolled in night classes and got her degree in business administration in 1954. In 1957, she was married briefly to American pilot Walter Gaida. He walked out of the marriage during their honeymoon in Hawaii after Flash Elorde, the boxer, gifted Rosa Rosal with his winning boxing gloves. Walter did not realize how big of a star she was and he couldn't cope. Their short union was blessed with one daughter, Tony Rosal. Rose Gaida. In the 1960s, when bomba films were a thing, Rosa Rosal spent more time on her volunteer work. In 1965, she was elected into the Board of Governors of the Philippine National Red Cross. Rosa Rosal has been honored with the FAMAS for her work on film, the Ading Fernando Lifetime Achievement Award at the PMPC Star Awards for Television, the Ramon Magsaysay Award for Public Service, and the Presidential Order of the Golden Heart for her work with the Philippine National Red Cross. Red Cross. Rosa Rosal has been offered multiple times to run for public office, but she declined. Instead, she used her significant influence to raise funds for the sick, the poor, the abandoned, and the battered. Kaling. Oh,